you guys, it's a big day because I got my second package of PR and I had never heard of this company and I really am kind of like wondering like how many other really great companies are out there flying under the radar just because um, I'm ignorant. I'm not ignorant. There are, there's so much good stuff out there to discover. And uh, sometimes it just, you just don't know unless you're watching um, my YouTube channel. So good for you, first of all, for being here. Um, second of all, the company is Prime Prometics and like cosmetics, but it's Prometics. And the cool thing about them is that they're this pro age type makeup company and they're focused on healing. So they are what they refer to as kind of an all natural pH balanced company with their products. And they reached out to me about trying their mascaras. So I uh, really, this truly was like a no brainer for me because mascaras are my favorite cosmetic product. So, uh, I love the idea of a company gearing their attention towards people who have uh, been around for a minute and tried several different kinds of products and know the difference between quality and something that is garbage and not worth your money. And so I got three of their mascaras. They sent three of their prime lash mascaras to me. One is in black, one is in dark brown, and one is in navy blue. I don't even know if you can tell that I'm wearing it right now. I actually have blue mascara on and the thing is like slow down. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So they're $28 each. So it's not a cheap mascara. It's not as bad as like some of the high-end stuff that you might find at Sephora but if it's a good product and if it is pH balanced and it's vegan, it's hypoallergenic, and it's good for you, wouldn't you pay a little bit more? Anyway, they have this specialized wand that's supposed to get into all of your tiniest lashes. I'm going to show you the wand right now. It's got this thickening, lifting formula. That's the blue. Isn't that pretty? That's what it looks like. I have tried all three colors. I've been playing with them now for a couple of weeks, and I want to share my thoughts on them with you. So, I'm going to do some voiceover work here on footage of me applying them and you can kind of see what the finished looks are going to look like. Okay, so blue mascara. This is not the blue of the 80s. This is more of a grayish denim blue. It can look good with any eye color, I promise. It will brighten the whites of your eyes, makes you look more awake. Something fun to play around with. How do you do blue mascara? Pair it with like oranges or coppers, peach eyeshadows. If that's too scary, use like a brown or a nude shadow and let that blue do the talking for you. I would suggest going in with like a white lash primer to make that color pop even more. And then you just keep the rest of your face simple, like a your skin tone, but better blush, a nude lip. And then if you want to try something that would make a really cool effect, go in on just the tips of your lashes with the blue and then do black elsewhere. So go on with black first and then highlight the tips with the blue for like kind of a comic book effect. Okay, so that's two coats with the blue. Now just to have a little bit of fun, and to switch it up and to kind of touch base on some of the things I talked about being able to do. I'm going to find the black one. Yep, here's the black. And I'm going to just touch the roots at the bottom. I'll mess it up. I'm just very gently pulling down here. You don't want to pull too hard. I'm trying to be really careful because I don't want to, I don't want to have to run my lash comb all the way through it. I'm going to stick it in about halfway through and bring it up. That is, there's no way I can get my phone camera in enough to be able to show you the effect that that has, but it, it's kind of cool. Now you have to be up close to be able to see it, but I'm going back in with more blue on the tips. I really do feel like the blue goes on best. And then on this side, I'm going to do just the blue on top and I'm going to do the black on the bottom lashes because I want you to be able to see what that looks like. Maybe I'll do some blue on the lower lashes on the other eye though, just for fun. All right, blue on top, black on bottom over here. I guess we can call this two coats over here because I've kind of been going at it. But do you see how... Mm, 
and you see how nicely on this side the blue applies. Something in the formula of this color. Had they not sent this to me, I never would have thought to try a blue. Just because, honestly, I didn't think that, I, I would not have thought that it would look nice with my eye color. This is probably going to be uh, good for some people as a mascara to use with a curling, curling, really curling eyelash curler, because my lashes are curling naturally with this formula anyway, and they don't always do that. So that tells me they would probably, it would probably hold a curl nicely. If you've tried this with doing that, you'll have to let me know. Okay, so I think it's fair to say this is basically like three coats on this side. And I'm going to go in with the black on the bottom. The blue on the tips over here with the black base, it's like the, uh, I'm going to dub that like comic book lashes. Does anybody already call it that? Did I just coin a phrase? What do we think? 